how can you customize your Calendly homepage? My name is Louise Brogan. I'm the host of LinkedIn with Louise. And today I want to show you how you can customize your welcome message on your homepage on Calendly. So let's get stuck in. And I just say, yes, I appear to have a cold. Um, so I apologize for the croaky voice. Okay, so we are on Calendly. Um, and I do have a paid account, but that will not affect the, what you're going to see in the training today. So we log into Calendly and Calendly, for those of you who aren't aware of it, is a scheduling tool where people can book in for appointments, workshops, or even discovery calls with you. I use it all the time in my business. How I use it is actually for discovery calls, um, client who are signed up to work with me on a monthly basis and they can book their one hour slot every month in advance. They can book it out as far as six months in advance. Um, and also when people buy my one-to-one -one VIP package, those people can also book um, their sessions online as well. So what does it look like to someone who comes to visit the page? If we click on calendly.com forward slash Louise Brogan, this is what we find. So there's the 30 minute chat, the strategy session, workshops, um, 20 minute call, VIP calls, and all the other options that are down here. I do need to tidy it up. Yes, I can see that. So, but what we've got at the minute at the welcome message is welcome to my scheduling page, which is the standardized message that you get from Calendly. So let's go into my account and account settings. So it's the top right hand corner account, drop down account settings. You'll see your profile photograph, your name, and then your welcome message. So if you click on this, it says, the welcome message will appear on your Calendly page as shown below. So let's update that. Welcome to Calendly and here, you can book your appointments, discovery calls, workshops, VIP sessions, and more. Okay, now let's have a think about what we actually want to write in here, because personally, I think that I could do with a bit of work. So we don't want this to be too long. So let's think about this um, welcome message because it is a welcome message. Welcome, if you would like to book your appointment with me, please use the options below. For more information oh, about how I work with clients, is it because actually, <clears throat> ideally if someone's booking a call to find out about my services I would like them to know in advance how much it costs so it saves them time and it saves me time you don't want someone to get on a call with you and then think oh that sounds wonderful but that's outside of my budget um, and then they feel a bit disappointed so it's much better that they come to the call understanding what the fees involved are uh, so I'll put that in there louisebrogan.com work with me that's a much better option, I think. And let's just click, um, we'll not click delete account. <laughs> we will click save changes. So the second thing I want you to look at in here is your branding. So if you click on the branding, this is perfect timing for me because actually I have updated my logo. So let's go and get the correct logo. What we'll do is we will click on update. And I'll just go and get my logo. Oh, somebody, uh, I forgot to turn off my messages. Apologies for that. Yes, this is the reality of uh, running your business online. <laughs> I'll click apply. Okay, so let's click save changes. So now, what does it look like if someone goes to my profile? Okay. Home. All right. And calendly.com forward slash Louise Brogan. There we go. We have got the welcome message in here. 
And if someone goes on to one of the options, they should see the proper logo in here. So I hope you find this useful. Um, I am very happy to answer questions that you have about using Calendly. Um, I know that some of you are interested in what you can do in the free version versus the paid version. For example, with the paid version, you can have members of your team accessing your calendar and setting up appointments as well. Um, but for most of us, the free version will be plenty. So do let me know what questions you have. And as always, I invite you to hit subscribe to the channel. Um, I, my intention for this channel is to provide you with valuable content that will help you build your business online, as well as learning how to use LinkedIn for business. Thank you, guys.